Well, hello there, sweet people. Welcome to the Sweet K channel. My name is Katarina. I hope I don't have a lipstick on my teeth. Let me double check it. So my name is Katarina and today I want to talk about the New Year's resolutions. I'm not the person who usually does this kind of things because I am really bad in actually following the idea or the resolution which I picked by this year I decided that I'm going to try it and I am going to do my best and see how will I stick with my plan and with my resolutions for the whole year. I did pick two which should be quite reasonable to do and if you are a creative person or if you want to save the planet this video is for you and you might find some inspirations and you might pick the same resolution as I did. First one is about the creativity. I did receive the amazing book for my birthday, which I have with me here. It was written by Anne Lamott and it's called Bird by Bird. If you are somebody who is creative and who likes to create the stuff and who has got a great imagination, you want to write, you want to make a videos or create any kind of thing, this book I would definitely recommend you to read. Anne is a um, very good writer or best-selling writer who basically wrote her tips or tricks how to be a better writer but even if you are not a writer you can use some ideas from a book how to stick with your plan and how your plan might go down the hill and it's okay and how your life might not look like how you want it to look like but that's okay as well uh, anyways this book is really great and it inspired me to start writing my journal so i did get another present for christmas which followed the book and that was a lot of writing pads or not pads so i can have my pet in every single room in my car in my handbag always with me if i do have any kind of idea or I've seen something or I've seen somebody or I've heard somebody or I just want to write something down um, I always have it with me I decided that I am gonna be doing my journal every single day kind of ish every day I started before Christmas or after Christmas when I received my notepads and it's kind of really nice it feels really nice you will get out everything from your brain what you went through during the day and it actually does feel very nice like you are sort of washing your brain if that does make sense it's sort of like a hygiene and I really really like it I started writing it I did skip a few days but any time when I remember to do it I would write it and I love it since I started doing it I already had few ideas for videos or for things which I want to create which I think is great I think what I need is to get all the thoughts out of my brain everything what I'm thinking about during the day just writing down on a piece of paper and let my brain to relax and maybe think about something else and maybe come up with other ideas I count myself as a um, creative person this is why I started doing YouTube obviously I like to create the stuff I like to do something where you can see your final product on the end I like to come up with the different ideas and do things which are not ordinary and which are not repeating themselves every single day because that I found really really boring and when I am bored I'm unhappy so I want to boost my creativity and I want to do something more interesting and this is the way how I decided to do it so definitely if you want to write a book for example or do something creative this book is really excellent as I said I did get it as a present uh, it's not a new book I think this one was released quite a while ago a few years ago but it's still really good you can still take whatever you need from the book and it might inspire you to do something for yourself to spend the time with yourself with your thoughts with your ideas and just you know invest to yourself you need to take care of yourself if you won't do that then you won't be really be able to enjoy anything in the life or to enjoy time with anybody else or you don't know I, in my opinion self-care is very important and you need to do it and you need to look after yourself so 
if you want to try it go ahead i will try to link it down below if i will find it somewhere it will be probably second hand book but i will definitely write all the details the name and the name of the writer so you can check it out online my second resolution, as I said, will be about saving a planet. As you can all see, everything what is happening around currently, all the fires in Australia and the crazy weather in UK. We have a very warm winter with a lot and a lot and a lot of rain, which is causing problems everywhere all around the country. We can see the differences in our climate and it's not good and it's getting worse and we are running out of time and it's not problems of the next generation it's the problem which is important right now and i want to invest myself even more into my zero waste and sustainable living as i did last year i did change a lot of stuff in my household and a lot of stuff in my life to cut down the waste and I think it did make a crazy difference if I compare how much rubbish am I throwing out right now it's such a little part of what I used to do um, I am trying not to even buy a recycling stuff or re stuff which you can recycle but I'm trying to really really be zero waste all the products around the household everything I'm trying to get compostable stuff and recycled but I would prefer something which I can compost or reuse myself I think I can do even more and I can do better and I can push myself to find more products and find um, different ways how to live my life to do my share to protect the planet I really really think this action is necessary and I want to be inspiration and I want to show people that it's not that hard it's really easy to do it uh, my huge inspiration as probably everybody else is Greta who as we all know I think is 13 years old girl and she spoke very openly and she is traveling the world and she is educating people and I think she is somebody who should be motivation of our generation or generation after us or generation before us we all need to look on a current problem we all need to realize what is actually going on on and we are running out of the time and then we can be better and then we can do better and this is what I want to achieve in 2020 is my year of exploring or exploding all these zero waste products and my sustainable living to make it better to save myself eventually money as well but also save the environment and I think I can do it and I will probably inform you if I will find some great product which you might like to use and which I will be very satisfied about. I did film few videos before where I showed you different skincare products I think and this different household cleaning stuff. I might do some updates because I did get more stuff of course I have much much more sustainable products around my house and I am extremely passionate about it and extremely happy that I do. So these are my two resolutions and these are two things which I think are bearable. I think I can achieve it and I can I can do it and I think I can be good in it and I hope this will motivate you or that this will kick your ass and you will do something for yourself. Your resolutions don't have to be big and I don't recommend you to give yourself something which you know for sure it's not achievable you should be you know trying to do things which are achievable so go ahead and do it good luck with your resolutions let me know if you do have some interesting one or if you do have any more motivation for me if you do have some new great uh, sustainable products that I am always open to your suggestions um, take care of yourself i will see you next week i'm uploading every tuesday i have more content coming and i'm excited to see you um, happy new year by the way i didn't say that i am still in a christmas spirit but i think i will have to get rid of all that um, decoration because it's not christmas anymore but i still live in a christmas spirit unfortunately this is not what is going on we need to start living <laughs> a normal winter life without nice and shiny christmas decoration so this is it from me thank you for staying with me subscribe to my channel like the video if you like it and i will see you next tuesday bye